Well, it's time for a children's message. So if we have any with us in here this morning, if you'd like to come on down. Wherever you get, that's where I'll look at you. Good morning. Good morning. Thank y'all for being in church with us today and bringing your parents. I appreciate that. <laughs> y'all feel good today? Yes. Have a good week? Yes. This is the best way to kick off a new week, right? Yes. So we just got done with summer. You've probably done a little bit of traveling, right? Or maybe you took a little trip through the woods. Have you ever done that? You ever been on a hike? All right, say we're going to go on a hike together. All right, and it's going to be a long hike. And it's somewhere we've never been before. What are we going to need to bring with us? Water, phone, <laughs> a mat, a compass, hiking boots, a scooter spray, spray, a mat. Good. One thing you mentioned that I want to pick up on is a compass. I brought y'all a little compass too. So. The Bible has been called a lot of things, right? It's the Word of God. And in, in Psalms it says, Your Word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. Right? So His Word guides us. It leads us. It shapes us. It forms us. It does a lot of things as we read it, as we study it. It helps us grow spiritually. Right? And a lot, speak, speaking of spiritually, a lot of people turn to a lot of different things when they need direction in life. Sometimes they base on how they feel or what other people think. But we need to base our life and what we do, our actions, things we, we say and do and think based on God's Word, right? The Bible. So here, y'all take one of these and think about, when you see it, maybe pick, pick the color you like. When you see these, y'all think about God and His Word being a, a, a director for your path of life. It helps you find your way. Maybe when you get lost, you always remember that God's with you. Alright. So let's pray. Thank you all for being here today, God. Thank you for being with these, your children, our loved ones. And we thank you so much that there are theologians who have a lot to offer the church even right now. So thank you that they're a part of the church, that they love you and they want to serve you just like we do. So Holy Spirit, be, be in them, protect them, guide them, watch over them, and help them have a good week in school this week coming up. In Jesus' name, for His sake we pray and all say, Amen. Amen. Y'all know the way back. Y'all know where you're sitting. If those break, let me know. I'll get you a new one. Amazon specials. <laughs> Here's the end. Okay, here you go, man. Pick out a new one. There you go. Maybe we'll do a two for two on that one. There you go. 